Which one do you want to open first? This one? It's a little present. Oh, wow! Sick. What is it? There's plenty of peanut butter squid in this. Mm. <laughs> a nice cutlet. Nice hot chocolate. That's a nice cutlet. Nice cutlet. Mummy has a coffee and Daddy has a tea. <sighs> Daddy's tired. Daddy's tired. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not surprised. Yeah, the thunder and the lightning woke you up, didn't it? Okay, so I'm going to talk over this because I'm having an allergy attack and I'm not sure anyone wants to see my face right now. But I am doing a free course meal later and I'm going to do the dessert now so I don't have to do too much later. Um, so I'm making cinnamon rolls, so let's crack on with it. Non più dry farfalon yamoroso, notte giorno di torno girano, delle belle turbando a riposo, ma ci sento a tocino d'amor, delle belle turbando a riposo, ma ci sento a tocino d'amor. Questi bei panachini, quel cappello leggero galante, quella chioma, quell'aria brillante, quel vermiglio donesco color, quel vermiglio donesco color. Non più frai, quei panachini, quel cappello, quella chioma, quell'aria brillante. Non ti drai farfalloni amoroso, notte giorno di torno gerato, delle belle turbando a riposo, 
Fianco, con lo dritto, uso franco, un gran casco, un gran turbante, molto honor, poco cantante, poco cantante, poco cantante. Ed invece del fandango, una marcia per il fango, per montagni, per valloni. Salioni al concerto di tromboni, di bombarde, di cannoni, che le barre tutti i toni, all'orecchio fan fischiar. Non più vrai, quei penachi, non più vrai, quel cappello, non più vrai, quella chioma, non più vrai, quell'aria brillante. Non più vrai, farfalloni amoroso, notte giorno di torno dorato, delle belle tormine d'or riposo, ma ci sento a tuo d'amor. Delle belle tormine d'or riposo, ma ci sento a tuo d'amor. Che rovino alla vittoria, alla gloria militar, che rovino alla vittoria, alla gloria militar, alla gloria militar, alla gloria militar. I think you call this rustic, rusticism. But they're about to go in the oven. It was a bit of a mess, to be honest. Like, an absolute mess. But let's hope they cook okay. It's the first time I've ever made them. And Tristan had to help, so. I'm just about to rub our steaks with some seasoning. We've both got different types of steak. Um, so if you are not a meat fan, you're gonna wanna look away. I'm gonna put some, I swear I had an all-spices meat seasoning, but I can't find it, so I'm gonna rub it with some of that. I'm gonna put garlic powder and thyme, sorry, that was really loud. Garlic powder and thyme, and then some salt. Some salt and some white pepper. So let's get everything on the plate so I'm gonna put quite a lot of this on because it's super tasty I don't want it to be too overpowering because I do have some sauce to go with it some thyme some garlic powder some white pepper and some salt, a nice mixture. And then I'm gonna leave this to marinade in the fridge. So Tristan has a, do you have a rump steak? No, mine's a sirloin. A sirloin, and mine is, is a fillet because I don't really like the other one. Need some more salt on here. Um, yeah, and then I'm just going to rub it in, so please don't watch this if you don't like meat, because you won't like this at all. Not that you can see too much of an angle, so you might actually be okay. Lovely. Yes, lovely. This, I'm doing the steak for dinner. You're going to have some chippies and prawns. And some steak, I don't know if you'll like it. Hello, feeling a bit better now. I can show some of my face. Um, camera's at a really awkward angle, but I'm just creating the starter for Tristan's Father's Day 3 course meal. I'm already extremely tired. I've, I finished my workout, which is why I'm wearing completely different clothes. 
but yeah let's crack on i'm making a very simple fresh starter for him it's literally sliced tomato mozzarella olive oil and salt and herbs um but everything else was pretty heavy so i thought i'd start on a light so yeah let's cook chose triple cooked chips to have with this meal uh, they are from frozen i could have made the potatoes myself the chips myself not the potatoes i'm not that far advanced um but i thought because i've got to do so much other stuff i'm just gonna cheat and buy frozen triple cooked chips and then over here i've got the steak out coming down to room temperature and we're about to eat the starter which looks so lovely and fresh but i'm getting there slowly so I hope Tristan likes it. I've got my butter melting in both my pans. Everything is a huge mess at the moment. Um, peas are on. Prawns I marinated in some... What did I marinate it in? It's not cumin. Cajun. Cajun seasoning with some peppers and salts. Um, and then I'm going to pop the steaks on. It's all coming to plan. Steaks are in. Pan is hot. Hopefully. Yeah. My god, I'm so excited. What's the matter, Sush? Oh. What is it? Is it the hot weather? A dinner fully fit for a father on Father's Day. We've got Cajun prawns, peas and butter, triple cooked chips, steak and sauce. Hollandaise sauce. Does it look nice? Nice. <laughs> Time for dessert. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Why did you do that? I just thought it was apt. I mean, is it nice? No. Wow. No? The old fox, doesn't he know there's no such thing as a gruffalo? On went the mouse through the deep dark woods, and out saw the mouse, and the mouse looked good. Where are you going to, little brown mouse? Come have tea in my treetop house. Hello, hello, hello. So it's much later on in the evening. Um, great Father's Day. Oh, jeez, that's terrible lighting. Get back around there, sorry. Yeah, so Great Father's Day. Had loads of fun. Loved all the presents. Just had a really chill one. So. We hope you enjoyed your Father's Days, hope you just had good weekends and we'll see you in the next one.